The caldera of a massive shield volcano forms the hub for Australia's green cauldron, a national landscape that takes in the northeastern corner of New South Wales and the Gold Coast hinterland. At its centre is Wollombin, or Mount Warning, the remnant of the core of the magma chamber, a towering cone-shaped peak revered for millennia by the people of the Bundjalung Nation, who call this special place Wollombin. It's a spiritual place, it's a sacred place, Wollombin. The Aboriginal people who know Wollombin have dreaming legends about its creation as well as sacred sites and places. Once a year, when a particular flower was in bloom, different tribes would come here from all corners of the nation to meet and rejuvenate their culture, a tradition that is kept alive to this day. The area is also held in high regard among botanists and ecologists for it truly is one of the world's biodiversity hotspots. Lush rainforests provide a home for thousands of plants and animals, with more than 200 of them classified rare or endangered. The Border Ranges National Park, which sits on Wollombin's or Mount Warning's western edge, is home to the highest concentration of marsupial species in Australia. And Lamington National Park on the Queensland side is clearly a haven for birds. The crimson rosellas, the beautiful regent bowerbird, satin bowerbirds as well. There's a whole raft of species. In fact, Lamington is one of the most diverse uh, places in Australia for bird species. If you take on the 20 kilometre walk between O'Reilly's Rainforest Retreat and Binnaburra, you'll encounter plenty. Indeed, you'll all but be tripping over them. And this is one of the spectacular things about this walk is being able to interact you know, with, with this sort of bird life. That is amazing. Aren't they just beautiful? The rich soils and high rainfall experienced in this region have allowed the forests of Australia's green cauldron to endure. And really, wherever you venture, you'll be amongst giants. Ancient and embracing, you can experience their wonder on foot or connect more intimately to it through art. But even the most passive observation from an easily accessible lookout or picnic spot along the rainforest way will leave you in absolute awe. There are waterfalls everywhere in the region, particularly on the Springbrook Plateau. And the view from the hinterland on a clear day will take in the distant coast, the flip side to this breathtaking landscape. From the Gold Coast to Byron Bay, there are plenty of places to hone your skills in the ocean. Or at the right time of year, Witness the experts in action. You can often sight these massive migratory mammals from a headland, but a boat-based tour will deliver a closer, more sensory experience. Regardless of your focus the first time you visit, Australia's green cauldron will leave you vowing to return. For more of the same, perhaps, or a completely different experience, highlighting the great mystery of nature. <laughs>